New tonight, we are looking at the implications of a newly signed bill legalizing hemp production. It could lead to more CBD sales. Yeah, we're talking hemp for CBD here, not marijuana with the high levels of THC, which produce the highs. 12 News reporter Jordan Foster digs deeper into all the changes. CBD, which comes from hemp, has been scientifically proven to help with things like anxiety, depression, and ADHD. Now, you may see more of it now that hemp farming will soon be legal in Texas. Monday, Governor Greg Abbott signed a bill legalizing the sale of CBD products with very small amounts of THC. It's good news for Cedric Palmer, who just opened a CBD store in Beaumont. We are the first and only fully stocked CBD shop in the Golden Triangle. CBD is primarily found in the plant hemp, which is a type of cannabis. We went to talk to Dr. Margot Gage, an assistant professor at Lamar University. She teaches the course on the medical effects of cannabis and says there's a difference between legal CBD products and marijuana, which has a higher concentration of THC. It acts differently than THC in that the common features, the psychoactive properties, that, that high sensation uh, is not what you get from using CBD. Dr. Gage says scientific research has shown that CBD can have positive effects on the body. We know that CBD does have potential health benefits. Joe Evans, general manager of Beaumont Occupational Service, admits the change in law will make drug testing a bit tougher. The CBD products do contain a small amount of THC, so if the lab picks up THC, then you're positive for THC. Evans says you will want to tell the drug testing company if you're using a CBD product. Uh, I would just use extreme caution in regards to what you're using. Palmer, who sells everything from bath bombs to gummies to popcorn, says now that this bill has been signed, he expects CBD sales to skyrocket. Everyone who's purchased has came back and purchased again. Like, they love it. The new bill signed this week makes it legal to start growing hemp, but this doesn't mean people can start growing hemp right away. First, the federal government has to come up with some regulations for hemp farmers. The earliest that law could go into effect would be 2020 of the farming season. Jordan Foster, 12 News.